the seizure of what is now the single largest seizure of heroin in the history of NDLA in the Muta Mohammed International Airport. I will give a brief recap in chronological order of how we came about the seizure of 51.90 kilograms of this class A drug. It started on February 10th, 2024, when NDLEA operatives of the Murtala Mohammed International Airport Special Area Command intercepted a suspicious package at the Sarko import shed of the airport's cargo terminal. The consignment was concealed in 15 cartons of 2,300 watt metal cutting machines. Each carton was topped with three blocks of high-grade heroin. In total, we recovered 45 blocks of the illicit substance with a total weight of 49.70 kilograms. After the discovery, we were methodical and meticulous in our investigations. We started with the arrest of the flight agent, whose name is Wasiu Babatunde. It turned out that he was hired for clearing service by MIP Logistics, <coughs> a company operated by one Mr. Kola, resident in the Republic of South Africa. Next, we conducted a follow-up operation at the company's warehouse in the Shogunle area of Osho, Lagos, and arrested the warehouse manager, whose name is Ajayi Moses. Thereafter, we set up an ambush for the expected receiver of the consignment, who was duly arrested when he showed up for collection. This receiver, whose name is Felix Chinedu, confessed during interrogation that he is the main distributor for a drug syndicate whose membership is spread across Nigeria. He admitted that he usually conveyed the consignment to a dedicated warehouse located in the Ipaja area of Lagos. That place served as a workshop where he would dismantle the consignment and remove the drugs from the machines. Thereafter, he would wait for a list of various recipients that would be sent to him from South Africa by the head of the criminal group. Our operatives did due diligence by conducting a thorough search of the warehouse, which led to the recovery of 56 similar cartons of the cutting machines that were used previously as modes of concealment to ferry heroin into Nigeria. Gentlemen of the press, at this point, it was clear that we were dealing with a syndicate that operates in other countries. By the time we were done exploring various leads we had, we had unraveled an organized criminal network that operates in South Africa, Mozambique, Nigeria, parts of Europe, and America. This syndicate has a wide network in Nigeria because the consignments we seized were marked with several code names showing that they belonged to different members of this organized criminal group. 
Furthermore, in our follow-up operation, we uncovered from the suspect a long list of receivers of NC drugs. In the end, we were able to identify the kingpin of the syndicate here in Nigeria, whose name is Reginald Peter Chidiebele. Our investigations showed that he owned the Golden Platinum Hotel and Suits, located at 16 Reginald Peter Chidiebele Street, Hope Estate, 